Hi there, and thanks for joining this Acumatica tutorial on generating credit card payments. So in many situations, particularly if you're generating recurring accounts receivable invoices, it may make sense to run credit cards in mass scale. So let's say, for example, you have a number of customers that maybe you're charging a service fee for every month, maybe help desk support, maybe rent or something along those lines. So in a previous video, we talked about how to generate recurring documents. And specific to this, generate recurring invoices. But in this case, what we're going to do is we're going to talk about if the invoice has a default credit card payment method, meaning the customer itself has credit card default payment, then when the invoice, when the recurring invoice is generated, that accounts receivable invoice will have that payment method in the financial details. So let's take a look at that. So I'm gonna use two sites here for the purposes of this demo. And if we take a look at uh, an invoice, we look at an open invoice, inside the invoice under financial details is this default payment method. So depending upon the customer, if their payment method here in the customer profile, it defaults to a credit card. Then when an invoice is generated for this customer, it will show default payment information as a credit card, one that we process, one that uses integrated processing. It'll show it right here. And if it does, then when we go to generate payments, which is the first step, it'll show you a list of all the invoices that have credit cards on them in accounts receivable and that can be processed. So the generate payments is under banking. First we generate our payments, then we capture our payments. Okay. So to get this started, I'm going to select this invoice down here because I do want to run it. Ordinarily I could say process all. And for multiple customers, all of these invoices would go into a single payment. So the generate payment is basically taking all the open invoices for all the customers and creating a payment for them. So, but now I'll check off this invoice and I'll say process. Again, I could process all, I could schedule this. Acumatica's processing screens allow you to make this happen automatically. But I'm gonna hit process. Okay, now that's done. And now if I go to banking and capture payments, I'll now see a single payment and I can check it and run process and I'll get my result. So Acumatica went out to the merchant account and it got an authorization and it cleared the screen right here. So it's that easy. At the end of the video, if you have any questions, reach out to us. Our contact information is there. Thanks so much for watching.